The faith originated 6,000 years before the War of the Five Kings in the continent of Essos, specifically in Andalos where, according to legend, the God of Seven manifested before the Andal people. Afterward the Andals sailed west and their invasion of Westeros began. Some of the Andal warriors carved the seven-pointed star, the symbol of their religion, into their flesh to demonstrate their devotion. Bearing weapons made of steel, the Andals conquered the first men and slaughtered the children of the forest, viewing their magic as an abomination before the seven. The Andals burned down most of the weirwood trees in the south, which are considered sacred in the worship of the old gods of the forest. Soon all the kingdoms of the first men, with the exception of the Kingdom of the North, fell to the invaders, who intermingled with some of the local dynasties, such as House Gardener, or replaced them altogether, as was the case of Mountain Kings of the Vale. As the Andals asserted their dominance over all regions south of the Neck, they asserted their religion over the first men they conquered, replacing the worship of the old gods almost entirely throughout the southern kingdoms of Westeros. Thus the Andals' faith of the Seven became the dominant religion on the entire continent, except for in the North and the Iron Islands. Prior to the rule of House Targaryen, the faith had the right to dispense justice, conduct inquests and trials and pass judgment over all echelons of society, including kings. This justice was enforced by the faith militant. However, this right was taken away from it by the Targaryen kings and, Whilst the faith remained an important part of Westerosi customs, they grew corrupt and their practices became little more than a facade. Nevertheless, the faith's importance could not be understated and most if not all noble houses had a scepter present in their household to raise their daughters, such as Scepter Mordain for House Stark, due to the influence of Catelyn Stark, who firmly believed in the gods, despite the fact that she had married into a northern family which worshipped the old gods. 